stay from home fires in the U.S. The American Red Cross and the West Fargo Fire Department is working to reduce that number. That's why they held a sound the alarm event earlier today. The goal was to reduce the number of fire related injuries and deaths in the West Fargo area and to educate people on fire safety. Valley News team's Joseph Ojo traveled with those who volunteered and shows us how today's event has made the homes of more than 450 people safer. Door to door, volunteers of the American Red Cross went knocking to install free smoke alarms. Uh, do you want to, would it be okay if these two young gentlemen came in and checked out your smoke alarms at all? Or? Yeah. And if a house had a smoke alarm already installed, the fire department along with the volunteers replaced batteries in existing alarms. But they didn't stop there. They also provided fire prevention and safety tips. Engage with people and make sure that they're prepared and, and thinking about uh, what would happen if there was a fire and uh, how to, to get to plan for that. The Red Cross is usually there to provide service to families who are displaced after a home fire. But Saturday's fire awareness campaign was a push to get everyone a smoke alarm prior to a home tragedy occurring because home fires are said to kill seven people a day in the U.S. I got home and they were in my neighborhood, so it was a fun surprise and really exciting, great service to offer. The team of volunteers which were dispersed into the communities raised awareness about the importance of working smoke alarms and even devised evacuation plans for families so everyone would be on the same page if a fire tragedy occurred. Uh, yeah, it was really exciting helping save lives. I said thank you because that's a decent thing to do. We need it. In West Fargo, Joseph Ojo, Valley News Live. And for those who may be physically unable to install fire alarms, the Red Cross installs free smoke alarms all year round. For the link to request one, you can head to our website, valleynewslive.com, and click on this story. We had a head sunny.